you should not start your prelims preparation again but start the mains preparation now you should think like that you are going to write the mains examination in 2024 itself Hello everyone, welcome to Plutus IAS. In this particular video, I will talk about the mains preparation, especially after the prelims results. As we have seen that uh, in the recent prelims result, so many people have qualified and there are people who haven't qualified the prelims examination, right? But there is a similarities between uh, these two categories of student. What is that similarity? The similarity is that both of them need to prepare for the prelims examination because those who haven't cleared the, this, uh, the exam this year ultimately they should be prepared they should be ready for the mains next year otherwise if you will not be preparing for the mains now then what will happen if you will be you know uh, certainly you will be clearing the prelims examination next year so it should not be like next year after the prelims result you got selected but still you are not ready for the mains examination so just to avoid that situation i am highlighting that both categories of student those who have cleared the exam and those who haven't need to prepare for the mains examination and for that i'll provide certain guidelines so please focus on this right so <clears throat> here are some yeah so you can see that uh, the preparation for the mains examination is quite different. One thing is very clear, both of them, both categories of students need to prepare for mains. But it is very important to note that preparation for the mains is quite different from the prelims. In case of mains, knowledge is not sufficient. Why these lines are being added? Because I just want to add uh, that yes now everyone should prepare for the mains why because i have seen people who after failing in the prelims will be starting prelims preparation again this is the wrong strategy we should not do this at any cost everyone should prepare for the mains the other reason is that if you will be prepared for the mains examination well then certainly it will be helping you in clearing the prelims examination so very very important cautioner uh, caution that i am you know giving to you that you should not start your prelims preparation again but start the mains preparation now you should think like that you are going to write the mains examination in 2024 itself accordingly you prepare then you will feel the difference okay so why why it is important you may be thinking that polity i'll read from lakshmi kant and you know ultimately it will be helping the prelims and mains examination that's fine but now it's time that you should be preparing every bullet of your syllabus according to the mains examination need and the demand why the reason is here knowledge is not sufficient to get marks in the mains examination but here it is equally important how you are expressing yourself in your answers how you will be expressing yourself and your answer will be ultimately deciding your fate how much marks you will be getting what rank you will be getting ultimately will be decided by your answers that you have you will be write, writing in the mains examination okay so for that extensively mains preparation is required for that extensive answer writing is required for that extensive study as per the main syllabus is required so it is very important that the time after prelims examination is being utilized for the mains examination irrespective of your result if you are really serious about your dream that is ias right so it is very important and one more thing i'll add what is that the thing is that uh, for example you are very very hard working person you are very hard working person and you are studying daily 10 to 12 hours okay right that's fine it's really good but do you think that the examiner who will be ex 
evaluating your copies will be looking into that you are very hard working person and you are working for 10 to 12 uh, hours studying for 10 to 12 hours daily no certainly that person will be judging you from your answers so we should work on improving our answer writing improving our way of presentation improving our way of expression otherwise ultimately uh, you know the examiner will be uh, judging you from your answers the poor answers or the good answer accordingly you will be getting marks right so extensive men's preparation is very much needed now it has been uh, written here then uh, yes so when and time and again I'm highlighting that it's time for means preparation uh, now for both the categories of student who have clear and who have not right so for this particular preparation we have come up with means mentorship program I'll write this here the means mentorship program means mentorship program right so what this program will be dealing with this program is available for those who are writing means this year 2024 and those who will be writing means next year that is 2025 okay so I want that all the serious students is following this plan and completing the main syllabus in a time bound manner this is very very important okay so this way you can prepare or otherwise also it's not an issue right but ultimately what should be there that preparation should be there for the mains and I believe the point that I, that, uh, I added are making quite good sense to you if you will be following the mains mentorship program provided by us at Plutus IAS you will be getting all these you know the facilities all these features in the program one we have planned for regular test there will be regular test will be conducted the daily weekly that is the sectional and the full length test and there are so many other features also like continuous evaluation and feedback daily you are writing the test we are evaluating we are giving the feedback this is what required because continuous improvements is the uh, key to improvement okay then there will be one-to-one -one discussion with the mentors one there will be one-to-one -one discussion like after writing a particular test you may have a doubt that how to improve because evaluator may have evaluated but still you will be having doubt for that we have the mentors specifically allocated to every student they will be having one-to-one -one discussion with all the students then specifically we will deal with how to make notes one then the two how to read newspaper effectively how to make notes is very important like other uh, other points because when you are reading something it is no uh, human tendency or it happens with everyone that if you are reading something today definitely you will be forgetting after some time like you will be appearing for prelims examination in the uh, you know May next year or the mains examination in the September this year so whatever you are reading definitely you will be forgetting so for that you should have your notes and how you will be preparing notes is very difficult without any guidelines so we will be actually providing the guidelines what you should be noting down in your notes and what you should not so other feature then how to read newspaper for the prelims examination for the mains examination we will be guiding on that also then how to revise effectively definitely sessions will be there and the next is how to improve on answer writing right so these are the features of the program that we are uh, planning to you know launch and definitely it has been already planned and uh, there are students who are enrolling so the ultimate purpose of this particular video is to give a message that after prelims result there is very uh, there is need for mains preparation very seriously to every student irrespective of your result this year right so I hope it will be helping you in your preparation further so this is all 
for this particular video. We will be meeting in the next. Thank you.